guys, Jennifer here. Welcome back to my channel. I am sharing a quick status update on what I've been working on. I have been creating some of these embellishment packs and I kind of wanted to get your opinion on some of the pieces that I'm putting in there. So this is just a uh, Panera bag that uh, my mom would get uh, her coffee there in the morning and she'd put her stuff in there and uh, she saved these for me. So I had several of these that my mom saved for me. So what I decided to do was fill them up with some goodies. And I decorated this um, using the Cozy Cashmere Papers and some little embellishments that I put together. So these are just layers of lots of bits, laces, and my bows from Cozy Cashmere. And then I had created these embellishments a while back. And so I put that here on the front with this little paper clip, just as a little added cute embellishment. And then on the inside, I have some embellishments that I've made previously. You can see how cute the bag looks. I line the inside and then the back as well, just so it's pretty to look at. And I had created these a while back. Um, so I decided to add these in this embellishment pack, as well as this cute little dangle. It is a little mini wooden embroidery hoop that I altered, made a little charm out of that. And then I altered this metal key. And then I also made a ribbon and lace dangle. I've shown these before, but I just wanted to show you what I'm going to be including in these embellishment kits. So I have uh, one, two, three, four, five things here. And then I created these cute little flippy scrap pads or whatever. I used to call them my scrappy pads, but so what I did was I took my snippet tags. I have this digital called snippet tags in my um, Etsy shop and they're four large tags on a page and then four mini tags across the top. And so I took the tag and I folded it down as my little flippy pad cover type thing. So, and then what I did was I added, I printed these tags two to a page so you get this size and uh, these are like half the size of these. So these are the larger ones that come with the large tags. And then, oh, here's the small ones. So then when I printed it two to a page or 50% of the size, you get this tag and this size tag. So I use this small tag on here as a little dangle. And I used my words of gratitude on there as well. And these can be used to tuck in little pockets or whatever. So that was one of the embellishments I made with some sari silk up here. And then I sewed those up and they look super, super cute. And then the other thing I decided to make was some book, book page pockets. And I had seen uh, Shabby Dabby Doodah do a mass make recently on these. And of course, uh, Patricia Veramontes, she makes so many cool book page pockets, um, but these are the very basic ones. And so I just had fun collaging them with some of my coffee dyed stenciled papers and the cozy cashmere. So I made a bunch of these and I think they turned out really fun. I have not decorated this yet this particular piece. But I did um, 
go ahead and put the bases together and then I sewed them all and they just look super fun. And what I like about this is that it's very neutral. So again, you can stick that in really any journal to be honest with you. And so I thought I would show you like how I was gonna decorate this one. Um, move this bag out of the way. And these embellishments. Maybe you want to look at this one. <laughs> Put these over here. So I printed out this page as well of the snippet tag digital. There's two pages in the snippet tags uh, digital, and this is one of them. So it comes with two journaling cards and four smaller tags. And so I printed this out. And I thought that that could be a journaling card. I think I'm gonna be sewing these as well because I did back them with my coffee dyed stenciled papers. And then I just thought that would be fun to just maybe stick um, one of these tags as well. And maybe even one of the 50% sized ones. That would be cute to have those three pieces in there to journal on. And then of course, I would probably add some lace here to the top of these, or you can take the bows from the um, Cozy Cashmere collection and see how cute that looks. Maybe use a bigger one, I don't know. I can't remember what I did with all my bows, but I think I used the most of them. So here's a larger size, that would be cute. Adds a little topper in there. And so I'm thinking here, I just uh, sewed up some sari silk and I thought maybe I could use one of these words. These words were in the um, Cozy Cashmere as well. And then these were from the Words of Gratitude Digital. So maybe that one would go there or I could use one of these. That would be fun cut this out. So you guys, uh, last night we were celebrating a friend of mine, well, my sister's best friend, and, uh, she, um, had a birthday and we went to the Alice in Wonderland experience. It's so cool. Uh, we all love Alice in Wonderland and Disney and stuff. So um, we obviously live in Florida by Disney World. And anyway, we had so much fun there. And the characters, uh, the actors were so cool. They all had their parts and we had to solve riddles and figure things out. And it was super fun. We had so much fun but uh anyway they i guess they're like a traveling thing and they're in this area right now Isn't too many bows i don't know but the bow is super duper <laughs> i gotta put that on there all right let's oh i don't have my glue thing on all right well we'll put that on there let's see if we need just a little scrappy of this and let's see a scrappy of that. There we go. Here's a big bow. <laughs> I printed all the ephemera and you know half sizes. So I have stuff to fill the pockets. That over here. These were super fun because literally you just cut the tag out and you fold over the top about, I don't know, maybe an inch and a quarter. And then you can stick in little bits of whatever papers you have and super cool. Hold on, my husband is calling me. Okay, I just added a little bow up here on this one. And I'm going to 
gonna go ahead and glue this down. And then glue this down too. Super fun. It'd be cute to just put a bow in there. And then I will definitely probably, well, not definitely, probably, I will be sewing these. <laughs> so I'm just going to tuck them in here and show you kind of what I'm working on. So if you need a quick embellishment that is easy to do and looks super cute, you can make a bunch of these and stuff them with um, some journaling cards and put a little bit of barely anything on there. And then you've got these two super easy, cute little embellishments. Aren't they fun? I hope you like those guys and that they inspire you. I know a lot of people are doing these. I was inspired. This one, um, I know Lori got us started on these little scrappy pads. And then I saw um, Lori, Lori Girl on the Ridge. And then I saw Lori Edwards and, and Lorette Chandler. And they both inspired me. All of them inspired me. And then Shabby Dabby Doodah's little pocket here. So I've got lots of inspiration from people. And I just want to give them credit for that. So thank you guys for stopping by. I hope this inspires you in some way. Have a lovely week. I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.